Another supreme drop is upon us. Week five for fall winter 21 is now. I feel like I'm chosen. Welcome back, friends, to another edition of Fauntleroy's Finest, and today, I'm gonna live cop on the Supreme website. I know that at least a few of you out there are wondering, hey, why can't this guy cop a razor and shave? Because I have to buy all these bricks. Ain't nobody got time for that. Yeah, she gets it. So today's big collaboration is the Thrasher collaboration. There's a few t-shirts and other items that are in this collaboration. Again, I don't have a ton of faith for these Thrasher items. I think if you're looking to resell, black XL t-shirts are probably your safest bet. Other than that, most of this week is going to be a hold and or just personals. As you can see, this line Live Cop is coming to you live from lovely Ensenada, Mexico. That's right, kids. You're looking at the only hype beast YouTuber that cops Supreme from international waters. Hey, that's pretty good. All right, I woke up really late, so I just want to jump over to the Live Cop before I miss out on being able to buy anything at all. So let's jump over to the computer right now. We are here. <clears throat> I'm up late. I didn't I didn't wake up early. I'm not even going to bother with the bot today. We are just going to go manual. Refreshing, refreshing, refreshing. We're going to get there. Go back to manual days. All right, I got my tabs open and I'm ready. We are late. It is ready to go already. Eight o'clock, 11 o'clock for East Coast. There we go. Boom. Let's do it. Add that sucker to cart. Boom. Boom. Add that sucker to cart. Boom. Accessory. Boom. Add that sucker to cart, and then I'm good. And I'm gonna try to grab this one, and this is it. This is gonna be the whole cart for the day. Come on, process it. Let's go, let's go, let's go. You can do it. Process this payment. There we go. Yes, all right. Exactly what I wanted. That's the damn live cop for you boys. I don't think I'm gonna go for anything else. I know I talked about those shirts and things, but if you got them, great. Hopefully you got him in XL, but literally this is the cart that I wanted. I'm good for today. I'm going to walk away with this one. All right, 14 minutes after the drop, let's take a look at what is still available. Yeah, both of the satin jackets, flannel shirts, obviously. Oh, look, these uh, these sweaters, are they sold out completely. Okay, yeah, they probably just didn't make too many of those. Uh, these are trash. Wow, yeah, the, the Arabic logos were very cheap. And look at this brown one. Oh, look, at they snuck it in there. They snuck in that little pink deal that one is going to do really well i was wondering what the colorways on the embroidery were going to be if they were all going to be different and they are and this was a cheap shirt so yeah it went pretty quickly and there's still a couple available but by the time that this airs i doubt they'll be in stock uh the hoodie is still in stock in some colors except for the pink uh, nobody bought this one the s logos so the pink one is gone the brown one is gone both of the jeans are gone the S logo sweatpants are still available. Okay, black and yellow sold out on the Thrasher shorts. Now, honestly, these to me were the best part of this whole collaboration. It's sad, but these shorts were the best part. That's what she said. I really do like this long sleeve. I like the green one. Literally, because I just bought a long sleeve and I know it's for the personal, I am not going to buy this one today. I, I don't need a long sleeve in Los Angeles. These shirts are decent. This Skyline shirt here is decent. I, I don't hate it. The game one is better. So the game tee has sold out in a few colorways, but it's still there, probably mediums. This hat was just not the business. I'm not really sure what they were doing. Uh, the ripstop hats, okay, so the black ripstop's gone. Uh, the camp caps are still there. I still think this is is a good one. This one might be a decent uh, secondary one because it also has the black patch. Let's take a quicker look at it. <laughs> yeah, yeah buddy. I do think that's a very nice hat. And yeah, and so these beanies are obviously still here. These beanies are trash. Oh, the canvas backpacks restocked. I didn't know they were coming back out this week. They don't go for too much over, but they'd be like 150-ish. So, I mean, I don't know. But yeah, these keychains are all sitting too. They won't sit for long. These are going to be items that people just throw in their cart. Definitely go purple if you're going to buy one. Oh, they were $18 too, so that's good. They were cheaper. So there you go. I'm sure you got whatever you wanted today. It was pretty easy for me to grab, and I'm on a ship next to Mexico, having to VPN in and all that kind of mess. So there you go. Great success. Great success. <laughs> Alright guys, that actually probably was the most successful cop of my life because I didn't go back and buy like two or three more carts. <laughs> I know for a fact that I get to win most sensible hype beast of the week. 
two hats and a keychain, and then I got out of there. No guilt buys, no extra cards, no long sleeve tees that nobody wants. I just went in there, got what I needed, and got out. And I saw you guys in the Discord did the same thing. I'm building a sensible channel here. We're not gonna go in there and just buy everything. We're gonna go in there, buy a couple of things, and then wait till next week. Because if you spend all your money on bricks, then you'll never have anything to spend when they do release something worth buying. It's science. The Thrasher items did and are still slowly selling out, so I don't expect them to be around forever. But if you did actually want any of these things, you shouldn't have had a hard time grabbing anything from this week. I think that Arabic logo wash shirt is going to be a really sneaky little item. Brown one had that little pink hit with the embroidery on it. I truly believe that that particular shirt is going to do really well on the market. It was very cheap as far as a premium tee goes, and that colorway is just very popular right now. So anyone that ended up with that one is going to be very very, very happy with their purchase. Got it! <laughs> Obviously, this video is not going to be very long, so before I go, I wanted to talk about the Palace Ivisu drop that's going to happen tomorrow. Anyone interested in reselling should take a look at this collaboration. Past collaborations that Palace and Ivisu have done have performed pretty well. Um, Ivisu is a Japanese company known for jeans, and the jeans that they're releasing in this collaboration are pretty cool. You look at them right here. They also have some t-shirts and some other items. The Ivisu jeans are what people like to buy. They are very high quality, and the people will pay pay for them. And in my opinion, for this week, Palace is going to have far more resale than Supreme. What the fuck? And if you're new to the channel and you liked what you saw, why don't you subscribe below? I do a couple of videos every week. Also, comment below what you got today or what you didn't get today or why you didn't get anything today. At least if you went after anything today in Supreme, you should have had a pretty easy time grabbing it. And if you weren't able to grab anything, maybe you need to rethink your life choices. This kind of stuff isn't for you. <coughs> All right, guys, now I want you to go out there, have a great weekend, and you know that I will see you next video. 80 degrees.